but this is what I believe. Uh, because I interact with a lot of filmmakers, a lot of young filmmakers, a lot of new filmmakers who are trying to get their films at festivals or trying to find an OTT uh, platform for their films. The, my note is, keep your eyes on the prize and do not think out of order. I have seen so many filmmakers who haven't written their scripts but are worried about pitching to OTTs. I have seen filmmakers who are showing their film on an edit stage to festival programmers and are changing the titles of their films because some programmer has told them, uh, you know, this title is not going to work or are over editing their films because some funding agencies have told them that this is not working and that is not working. Or I've seen filmmakers who are like, yeah, I'm just about to do my sound design. I'm just left with the sound. Now I'm thinking about how to promote it, how to distribute it. Let your producer do that. A, just find a good producer to think about those things or B, Finish your creative process, finish what you have set out to do and then start thinking about these things. Be a little patient. The thing is, every process is important and you have to avoid distractions at all cost. Is my personal belief. This is what I tell people. Because it is not just the sound. It is sound. It is going to shape your film in a very big way. It is not just the fact that I have written an outline. I mean, I, I got a call from actually, you know, uh, I guess quite like a very like talented and promising young filmmaker who's from a film school nearby and with a bit of a presence and she's like I'm going to write the most amazing script I need to meet you to find out what are the practical problems in filmmaking I'm like really it's so easy to write a script she's like yeah, yeah the script's going to be great I'm like so if it's so easy why don't you write it and then meet me after you're done writing the script no, let's just, uh, that, that will happen. I'm like, I've been struggling for a year and a half to write a half decent script. You're telling me that the script is going to be awesome and you haven't written it and that it's going to be so easy to write it. I have a problem with this, you know. Same, same with a lot of people who are in the process of post-production, but they've already started thinking about other things, you know, about release, about... The, the problem is these are distractions. They are going to pollute, adulterate your mind. They are going to create all kinds of doubts. And the work that you have is going to live forever, hopefully. Is, is what's permanently there. You cannot let it be guided or distracted or adulter be adulterated by five random people telling you five random things. You know, live at least, uh, you know, make your own mistakes. Live with your own failures if you have to. Don't let it be the failures of others. You know, and again, in a similar vein, I tell people, if you're making films or if you're being in a, if you're in a creative zone, avoid social media, avoid news about which film is making, which, how much money, avoid uh, gossiping about, you know, what is happening in the market and the industry and iske saath kya ho hai, uske saath kya ho hai, iski project kya ban hai. Just shut up and do your work because again, these are just ways of wasting time. These are bottomless pits of creating anxiety within yourself and feeling uh, inept, you know. And these are the real problems that people have today because of too much exposure, you know, and everybody knowing everything and broadcasting everything about what's the good things in their lives and never the bad parts, you know. So again, keep your eyes on the prize and focus on the process. The process is everything is my personal advice to filmmakers who are starting out. You can choose to uh, ignore